there's a dog somewhere out there named Diana, and I want to know why. Um. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to my channel. So today I am really excited because I'm starting, um, it's probably going to end up being a mini series just because it won't be very long. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I'm going to be starting a little mini series. Um, it's been going around a lot. I saw um, Vixella just started hers. I've seen Deli from Deligracy do it. I've seen um, Claire Siobhan and Lauren Z. Side. Um, everybody's doing it pretty much. It's it's popping, um, and it is the BitLife controls my Sims challenge. Now, I am not fancy, so I don't have um, editing software that allows me to like overlay screenshots or like anything like that. I also can't record my phone. Like I can do screen recording, but the software that I use to record only records like my computer and like live whatever. So what I did was I went through. And I went through everything on BitLife and I wrote everything down, <laughs> which yes, in retrospect, I could have just screenshotted everything, but you know, that's just me. I like to make things more difficult for myself. So, um, yeah, and it's really kind of dark outside. I started as a toddler, um, because you can't make a baby and create a sim. So yeah, let me go ahead and hop into Create a Sim so I can show you all our outfits and introduce you to the family. Okay everyone, so we are in Create a Sim and this is going to be um, me, I guess. And our name is Riley Porter. We have a dog named Diana. She is a Labrador Retriever and she is four years old. Our mother is Mary Jo Porter. She is actually a reporter. So Mary Jo Porter, the reporter. Um, so I went ahead and gave her the writer aspiration. And she is outgoing, a perfectionist, and creative. And then our father is Julian Porter. He is an accountant. So I gave him the fabulously wealthy trait, which gives him business savvy. Um, he's also a genius ambitious and neat which I feel like that just kind of sums up an accountant and this is his outfit I'll go ahead and start with his outfit so this is his everyday just because he's an accountant and he has to wear this every day <laughs> um, his formal athletic I, I really did pretty basic outfits um, for the parents, because we're not really going to be playing them that much. We're just going to be seeing them. So, hot weather and cold weather. Okay, and as for our mother, Mary Jo, like I said, she's a reporter. So, I, I put her in this cute, like, businessy outfit. I know that my, um, my sim from the Boss Babe series is in a variation of this, but I just think it's so cute, and I put her in cute little heels to match it. Um, so here our, here are her outfits. Okay, guys, so my audio actually cut out, like, right here. I don't know what happened, but, um, yeah, I was just talking about how pretty she is, and how I think she's perfect, and going through her outfits. Um, like I said, they're nothing special, because we won't be playing her. But, yeah, anyways go to our outfits little Riley Porter um so yeah I have this custom content little onesie um and it is just look at the little buttons on the butt it's just the cutest thing come on it's so cute and for formal this cute little dress I definitely went like all pink with her I feel like she's very uh, like a daddy's girl little princess um yeah, little onesie. Um, this is a custom content onesie by, um, I believe it's Georgia L M on Tumblr. I think it's right. There might be something else in there, but if you type in Georgia L M C C, like it comes up. And our party wear. This is like a little Wednesday Adams dress, which I thought was just so cute. And I totally okay, y'all don't kill me. But when Seasons came out. I didn't realize they gave us swimsuits for the toddlers. Like, 
once I started making Sims videos, I didn't watch them as much because I was focused on mine. So I had no idea that you could put swimsuits on toddlers. Look at how cute this swimsuit is. They're adorable. Come on. Come on. Um, okay, and just like some little overalls for hot weather. And the cutest. This came with Get Famous, okay? I never look at the toddler stuff because for so long they didn't really give us anything for toddlers in new packs. But like, guys, this is from Get Famous. And tell me, tell me that this is not the most adorable thing you've ever seen. It's like princesses. She's a princess. Oh my gosh! I also think that she's just such a pretty toddler. And then I put her in little Ugg boots. Um, and I gave her the angelic crate. So, yeah. That is everything. So, let's hop right into the gameplay. I am so excited! Okay, guys. So, the first thing I'm actually going to do is have our parents join their careers. Now, I know that there aren't actually, like, there's not, like, an accountant career and, like, a reporter career. But I'm going to give them the jobs that I think are closest to them. So, I think for him, um, since he's an accountant, I might just give him the business career. Because I feel like that's the closest thing to it. I, I saw this one and it had money, but like, yeah, I think that business is closest to it. So, he's going to be a mailroom technician. And then she is going to be a reporter, which I think I'm going to give her the writer career. Because I feel like, you know, she's writing stories and doing whatever, so, like, that counts. Like, it doesn't necessarily say TV reporter, it just says reporter. So, yeah, I'm going to give her the writer career. And so that's done. Now, the first thing that happened when we turned one was our dad got promoted. So let's go ahead and promote him. Wrong one. Oops. Um, career cheats. Career promote. Okay. There we go. So, Dad got promoted. Um, obviously, it's not the same name because why would it be? Why would they make it that easy? And then, so pretty much from the time that we are two and on, like, nothing really happened. So, and we couldn't really do anything because we were still, like, an infant. So, um, the only thing we did, we spent some time with our dad. So, let's go over here. And let's, um, let's snuggle with our dad. Yeah, that's pretty much all that happened. We just spent a bunch of time with our dad. I feel like our mom, with her being a reporter, she's, like, so involved in her work that she's kind of, like, distant. You know what I mean? So, I feel like she's totally going to be a daddy's girl. Like, completely. What is the dog scared of? Is he ignoring us? Come snuggle your daughter. Oh, she's scared of the computer. Oh. Okay, you come over here. Why are you playing with the dollhouse? Um, friendly. Calm down, Diana. Oh, I missed the snuggle. I was trying to calm down the dog. Okay, but tell me why. Okay, I know they're frozen. But, like, tell me why she looks so evil. She's like, give me what I want, daddy. Please. Um, Not even please. Just give me what I want. Okay, anyways. <laughs> so he reached parenting level one. So they're both on parenting level one. I'm not really going to worry about skills or anything like that. Like, it's just literally... It's just bit life. So, yeah. Um, For the rest of the time, it was just nothing. So, next thing I know... Oh, so when we turned five, it came up and it said, I'm starting to think my dad may be a superhero. Which is super cute because she's, like, so little. And obviously, like, little kids always think that their dad's, you know, a superhero. A superhero. Why can't we talk? I was going to say superhero. Like, cheerio? But, so, let's do play, because, like, the animation for playing kind of looks like, um, like, Superman, like, superhero-ish. See, there she goes, straight to what? Tiss, tiss. They're gonna play, and I'm gonna try and get some really cute screenshots. 
screenshots of mom playing in the back. Aw, look at them. Oh, sorry. Oh, <laughs> they're so cute. Look at that. You see what I mean? It's like a superhero. He's like, I don't know. That's just what it reminds me of. She's on his back. I know it's like an airplane, but that's just what it reminds me of. It's so cute. I love that animation. So um, after that, let's go ahead and actually you stop playing video games. Come over here and let's bake a cake. Um, oh, no, not under bake. It's under cook. I haven't played in a hot minute, if you guys can't tell. Um, so we could do a chocolate cake. A hamburger cake or let's just do a white cake it has like confetti on top that works so you go over there and make the cake I told you to stop playing book lock I hate that they do that I hate that it's literally like they just always want to play on their phone or like get on sims forever or whatever I don't know it's just it's just kind of annoying so then we are going to, to a child because the next thing that happened is when we turn six, we start elementary school. So she's gonna go play while she is making the cake. And why don't you come over here and let's be friendly. Let's praise Diana, which first off, who names the dog Diana? Like, that's a pet peeve of mine. Like people that give people names to animals. You know what I mean? Like, I knew a guy one time that had a cat named Toby. I don't know if he adopted him and he already had the name, but still, like, who names the cat Toby? Who names the dog Diana? Like, I would like to know, who came up with this name? You know? And I know it's randomly generated, but I'm sure there's a dog somewhere out there named Diana, and I want to know why. Um, <laughs> thank you for coming to my TED Talk on animals with people names. <laughs> um, Anyways, so the cake is in the oven, so why don't you come over here and pick Riley up? She's so cute, and it sucks that she's not going to be a toddler for much longer. Oh, let me show you around the house. So, in case you didn't notice, um, everyone's favorite family, the pancakes, yeah, we kind of... Oh, no, we didn't. It wouldn't let us. I wanted to kick the pancakes out of their house. I literally thought that we kicked the pancakes out of their house. Okay, ignore me, but we live right across the street from the pancakes. Um, so, yeah, so this is our house. It has, like, a little garden and a little grill. This whole time, I was thinking that we were kicking the pancakes out of their house. Wow. Um, so, yeah, we've got the little dining room. Um, I kept the dining room and the kitchen kind of how they were. I changed up the color schemes. Everything's pretty much, like, blue and, like, grayish. Um, so, yeah, here's the kitchen and the dining room. Little bathroom back here. And the living room is just, yeah. Um, upstairs, we've got a little play area for Riley. An office. Riley's room, which I told y'all, she's a princess. And the master bedroom and another bathroom. So yeah, that's it. Um quick little quick little house tour. Okay, so he's gonna pick her up and then you come over here. Let's add some birthday candles. Okay, this dog like bugs out over everything. <laughs> so she added birthday candles and come over here and have Riley blow out the candles. Okay, so Diana is obsessed with the sink? I don't know. Oh, we missed it! Okay, well, she is turning into a child, so. <laughs> Let's turn into a child. Come on, do this. Okay, Riley aged up. Her trait was angelic. Now, I don't know. Okay, first off, why does she have blue hair? Um, We'll deal with that in a minute. So, her trait was angelic, so I think I'm going to go ahead and make her, like, a social butterfly. Um, social butterfly. And have her be cheerful. Okay, so I'm going to go into create a sim and um, fix her real quick, so just give me one second. Okay, guys, so I went ahead and redid her outfits. Isn't she just the cutest and her little hair? Um, so this is her everyday outfit. This is her formal, her athletic, 
sleep, party, swimwear, hot and cold. And yeah, so. Okay guys, so my audio cut out right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and end it off. Um, there was no gameplay after this. I was ending it off anyways, but the audio was weird. So anyways, I really hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please leave it a like and subscribe to my channel. You can also hit the bell icon ne next to the subscribe button to get notifications when I post. If you like, you can also follow me on Instagram and Twitter at BlueBonnetSims. And I hope you have a great day and I will see you in the next video. Bye bye